Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of GNG News. So this guy got his karma, and I'm really glad that he did. So, 2.5 jackpot winner, Edward Putman charged with alleged fraud. So, he apparently won £2.5 million. A lottery winner faces trial after he was charged with fraudulently claiming £2.5 million jackpot nearly 10 years ago. Edward Putman... 53 submitted a lottery ticket in 2009 to claim the multi-million pound prize from Camelot. However, in 2015, police in Herefordshire began investigating when it was alleged that Putnam's ticket had been fake. The investigation did not lead to any charges because Camelot was understood to have misplaced the winning ticket. Officers said they had charged Putnam from King Lansley with fraud by false representation and bailed him to appear in court on the 16th of October. The Gambling Commission fined Camelot three million for handling of the payout. So, I think Edward Putman is a piece of shit for using a fraudulent ticket because that's not fair to whoever actually won. So, you know, and Camelot should really be on top of this they should have some sort of way that like when you get a ticket or something it prints something like not just a barcode but something that signifies that that ticket is that ticket so that people can't just pick up a ticket off the floor and take it in and then be like oh look this is my ticket they must, they have to develop some sort of way of well even if they've got a like i don't know maybe see your id or something because this is a right because someone's been robbed for 2.5 million pounds and i i don't think that to be fair so i'm glad that he got in shit for this and the national lottery you know they really need to sort it out because that's not fair i know people who religiously play the lottery you know w wanting and wishing and hoping to win and someone like that can essentially just take a ticket that isn't there that isn't theirs and claim someone else's money to me that's wrong let me know what you think about this in the comment section down below thanks for watching the episode of gng news i'll catch up with you all very very soon in another video